it's a suspicious fire and there's a uh, per person of interest that they're uh, currently looking for. That person was identified because of accusations like this. Made to First News reporter Derek Lewis during a live interview on the scene at 5 a.m. today. It was because of my cousin, and I don't want to mention no names. Your cousin? Yes. Um, and you say you think your cousin started this. Uh, do you know how or why? He's mad because he, couldn't, he can't get with me. I'm married to my husband. We're not identifying that man because no charges have been filed. Investigators say they just want to question this person and see where he was and what he was doing at the time of the fire. Now this garage behind me is where investigators say the fire originated, but they're still working to determine what exactly sparked it. It spread from that garage to two houses and another garage. Dennis Tenney owns the garage where it started. His wife made the accusations this morning. And the first thing that popped in my mind is it's all gone. It's all gone. Everything I've worked for, everything I, I had that was precious to me was in that garage. There were tractors and generators in the garage. Tenney says he didn't have insurance on them, and he's also suspicious of the fire's cause. 